Hi guys, thanks for joining me. Um, I wanted to do a video today with a full face of makeup. It's just kind of fun. I've been really enjoying getting my makeup on. And I've already done my first layer of airbrush foundation with the Bellalicio. I'm just using up this bottle. This is the Cappuccino. And I've already done my NW25 concealer to cover my discoloration and my major acne situation around my chin due to these masks that we have to wear, which I'm not complaining. But I wanted to talk to you today about, um, I took off my eyelashes, my eyelash extensions. I lasted about two weeks. They weren't for me. I just like changing around my eyelashes. I don't like walking around with gaps. And if your eyelash tech doesn't show up, you can't get a fill. <laughs> so anyway, um, first thing I thought of when I got them taken off uh, was uh, what eyelashes could I get that could be perfect and look gorgeous all the time. I met this company up at iMats in Canada. I had driven up from the US there. Um, it just happened to be closer and I'm originally from Canada so it was really fun to go back up. This was years ago and they were called Velour. They had gorgeous lashes. I bought a pair and I loved them and for some reason I did not order them again. I don't know why. But they were the first company or lashes I thought of when I got my eyelash extensions off of because they're just as full. And you can wear these mink lashes up to 30 times. And if you're careful, um, you know, don't sleep in them and like take care of them. They don't get ratty. So um, I got the Velour Mini Essentials Kit. They had a special going on for $30. And in the kit, I have a choice of what lashes I wanted. They gave you a selection of six. I picked the Wild Child. And this is similar to the first ones I got years ago. And really fluffy and soft. And it comes in this really heavy case. And then I got the Lash Clean Oil Makeup Remover. And this is good if you have eyelash extensions or if you're just doing strip lashes. So that was really neat. And then as well in the kit, you get a little gold mini applicator, which I always forget to use, but I need to start doing. And then you get the Lash and Go Eyeliner and Lash Adhesive, so it's black and it looks like eyeliner and I'm super excited to try that out because I do love my black eyeliner. And then as a bonus, you get a free lash adhesive little sample and I love carrying these around for travel or throwing them in my purse for emergency little pops or touch-ups. So that's really cool. So that was a very cute little kit. I wanted to talk about that and today we're gonna do a full airbrush makeup look. Um, and I think I'm gonna go with um, I'm going to do some pinks and I'm going to do a bright green in the corner. We're just going to have fun and do something creative. I'm just trying to come up with some really creative eye makeup looks, airbrush with mixed in products, whatever works to get the goal and just create something fun and stunning to kind of kick up the energy with these times. So um, I'm going to be using a bright fantasy oh, electric green for the inner corners, the magenta, um, electric for the lid and then I'm going to actually I'm going to use that as my base and I'm going to go underneath the eye and then for the kind of the shimmer and the kind of the darker pink I'm going for shocking and it has a shimmer in it so I'm not going to do the whole eye just parts of it and then if I want to darken it up I think I'll be adding in some brown I'm just going to go with the hot chocolate so it kind of brings down some of the colors but I still stay poppy and bright Anyway, my last video I didn't talk, I just wanted to be creative, so I'm going to do the same thing today, but I decided to do a small intro before I started in case um, you were wondering about the products, and let's get started. Thanks.
guys. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I wanted to do this final kind of ending. I added in a couple extra products. I also wanted to mention that the Velour uh, liner adhesive was amazing. And then I went over top with a little bit of actual liner, but it's just like a real liner and it's you can feel that it's sticky. So that was really cool. And it, the lashes just right away grab them, not like the regular lash glues where you have to wait at least 60 seconds. So um, that's exciting. And it looks like a liner, so you just have to be careful how you're applying. Um, I got a little bit of gloves that I cleaned off of, so I don't know if you caught that. But um, I purchased all these products, so I'm super excited that these were really good. And then I actually used my little lash tongs, which I always forget to do. And uh, jewels are by Jeweled Bunny. So I hope you enjoyed this look. Everything's listed below. Please like, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate your support. Thanks so much for watching. And click the bell for notifications on my latest videos. All right? And I hope that inspires you or helps you stay glam inside and out. Bye-bye.